Hello everybody, it is I, the Waluigi Big Neck, and welcome back to Sonic and Sega. I keep getting the name. I keep forgetting that this is Sonic All-Star Racing Transform, not so Sonic and Sega. That was the first game. But anyway, welcome back to Sonic Sonic and All-Stars Racing Transform. This time we're gonna be doing the Classic Cup. So these are all courses from the first game. Sonic and Sega All-Star Racing. So, the first one is Sunshine Tour, which is the Summit Amigo map. Shibuya, Shibuya Downtown, which is from... This is technically from Chesset Radio Future. Third one's Roulette Road from... Like I'd probably say Sonic Heroes, I think. And then Egg Hangar from the Sonic Stairs. I don't know which... Don't know which, uh, which Sonic games come from, but... But the Egg Hangar is also a DLC map for the first... For the first game. You can really only get it on the 360 and the PS3 version. Alongside with Metal Sonic. I think that's how it goes. Anyway. Choose your difficulty. Now one now unlike the uh, retro cups in like Mario Kart 8 or 7 where they where they add in some unique stuff that allows uh, that makes it instead of like adding in like some changes to, to incorporate new mechanics, these that's courses right. are literally just Character are literally just the normal courses. However, how about we play Ralph? We're gonna be playing Wreck It Ralph, and I'll be doing the. Let's see. Ah, uh, no. I'll be going. Uh... Oh, really not. I'll go with the acceleration mod. Acceleration. Alrighty. Yep. One thing I should also mention, the music for all these courses all come from the first game, which are text- And all the music from the first game are also- are also the original songs from the, uh, from the series of Origins, so... Get ready. So, there isn't really any dub center. Three, two, one. Oh yeah, seeing as Sama the Amigo, one thing that's weird with with the lore of the game, so 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 Amigo, which is the main character, I believe he's Brazil he's Brazilian, but he looks Mexican. Like like that's weird because technically because technically Brazilians speak uh, Portuguese. Also, one thing to mention, this is not Ralph's voice actor, this is actually, like, someone who sounds like him. It's kind of like a similar situation where, in uh, Kingdom Hearts 3, they, uh, they couldn't get Tom Hanks to play Woody, so they got his brother to uh, do it. But yeah, this track is pretty easy, because they... Cause I think, I think this was, this course I'm pretty sure was in the first, uh, cup of the first one. But this course, uh, is pretty, is really... Wreck again. But this but this course is really dress heavy. Because because there's like a lot of turns. And it's really easy to get level three uh really easy to get uh level three dress here. Alright, Knuckles is, is in the front line.
and we ended up with another third place. Just look at that smug face. Results. I I I still find it funny that Wrecker Ralph is is in this game. Like it makes sense when it like it makes sense when the game came out in 2012. But but now but now I'm playing it in 2020. It's it's still really funny for me. <clears throat> and I mean, I mean, I wish I wish Sumo and Sega made another one of these games because because they have a lot more characters they can actually add in now. Like like it would be pretty sick to see a uh, Joker for, Joker from Persona 5 in one of these Sega racing games because technically Atlas is. Is owned by Sega, so technically the Persona series is a Sega property. Get ready. Three, two, one, go! You just are on my first I'm class. So good, I'm ready to win the medal. Oh yeah, Ra oh yeah, Ralph is doing his medal. Confirmed. And the song you're hearing right now, this is uh, Don't Let Mom Sleep, uh, Sleepless uh, Remix or whatever. But it's the remix from. But it's a remix from. Just uh, that radio feature. Oh, uh, well, well, here's a good song. Well, at least I hit it a little while there. I was probably prob able to do it. Oh, hey, nice, I evaded it. As Vice just crashes into a into a wall. I wonder I wonder I wonder if this is gonna be like uh, the previous cup where I get a third or first a uh, really low rank and then uh, then like a third or a second again. Uh oh. Oh, now, one thing I should mention about the trick, if you do it way too fast, then you lose the boost. Doesn't matter, I won the race. I totally wrecked that race. Results. All right, I'll go grab. I'll go grab my coat. Why not? Do I finish the race? Then I'll grab my coat and leave in shame for making a terrible pun. Well, of course I get an item on the on the. Crack about uh, casinos. Okay, this is actually one of my favorite tracks from from the first game. Get ready. Three, two, one, go. Oops, I probably should have saved that. 
but oh well. But one thing that's really weird, at this point it feels like everyone's going slow before speeding up. Very cool game. Thanks for thanks for getting rid of my uh the love there right as the uh drone was gonna hit me. Cool, the football manager uh, took the hit. Firework. The sword is actually low key somewhat easier in transform because you don't have to worry about the uh, sonic bumper as, as I proceed to get stuck on the wall. Does that make me a hypocrite then? Here I come. I'm gonna go this way this time. Oh, I missed the item box there. Uh-oh. I better start driving fast. Wait, what? Wait, what is my star doing there? Right star, should... So, right star is the flag bearer for the racers. I mean, it's not terrible, but yeah, Ralph is not really a good character. On, like, this is another one of those courses that that has a lot of sharp turns that can kind of throw you over. But I'm still, I'm still ahead by three points, so I ain't, I ain't complaining. Finally, the last course, the Egg Hanger. Yeah, another drift heavy course. And there's, and there's and there's one spot they can actually get uh um like there's an easy spot you can actually do like a multi flip or something like that. Oh, 
the typical one would have been good. So, so there's one item I can not explain yet. Oh, okay, never mind, got it. So the super glove. Or so so with the so with the regular glove, whenever an item hits you, it'll the glove will disappear. But with, but with the super glove it stays for the same duration as the regular glove, but you can use it multiple times if you get hit by an item. Or and all and the gloves also work on blocking obstacles in the in all star attack. Speaking of which, so Browse is another area they said uh, also, but like essentially, essentially Ralph has has gi a giant wrecking, two giant wrecking balls spin around him. At least, I, at least I was able to show off uh, his all-star, because Ralph had a really low all-star, uh... He had, a, he had a pretty low all-star, uh, rate. Stay out... Stay out my way, Pete. Oh, I know, uh... Yeah, somebody will get hit by that. Man, everyone's, everyone's getting all stars. That's unfortunate. Also, every time you hit a wall, you lose your you lose your boost for the drifting. Well, it doesn't matter because I stole the first place. That went a lot more better. But hey, at least I secured my first place. At least I hope so. Results. Yes, I did. Good. Well, that's all the regular cuffs done. However, I'm not done yet. Because there are still... There are still five mirror cups uh, left we need to do. It's kind of funny just seeing Ralph just on there. Select a cup. So, I hope you guys enjoy the uh, episode. If you do like the if you do like the content they do, then please consider subscribing. Uh, other other than that, if, uh, if if you have any suggestions on how I can improve my videos, because to be quite frankly, I think my videos aren't are really that good. Uh, then please just leave your suggestions in the comments below. Uh, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy your day, and next and I'll see you next time for the mirror version of the Dragon Cup. Other than that, goodbye.